thought you were against this game. I, I didn't buy it. This was not my money spent. You can thank Caleb and uh, t Tyler. I almost said Jacob again. Well, Jacob might have. He might. Yeah, yeah he, he might, might or might not. All right, so uh, let's get in, I guess. Dad, Dad tip number thirty-nine. They really stepped up the production value of episode four. Episode five. All right. So Austin, come here. You have to make me as a dad. You have to. Yeah, Fine then, Quinn. Help make me, as a dad. Dad. <coughs> make me as a dad. Moose doesn't have to. Moose doesn't have to have any role in this. Because those that want to be in here. I'm just trying to read over the damn thing real quick. I just want to be able to launch this All right. Night, so we can finally be done with that five-month project. Let's know that snoring, Caleb. You don't know how I snore. Yeah, this is vibrator going off. <laughs> Makes sense. Dad. Okay, you're you're gonna be my daughter then. Uh, who else is here to speak? But, um, is it, you gonna be the daughter? No. Nope. Do you want me to be the daughter? I don't give a shit who's the daughter. I just, I feel like Austin would make a good daughter. <laughs> except, he's, except he's reading shit. Yeah, he's reading shit. Okay, so you can be that until and then. <laughs> I'm Austin filling. Is... I'm filling it for now. Dad. Dad. Wake up. Yeah. Pretend to be dead. Do you have to make decisions? I let my tongue roll out of my mouth and stop breathing. Yeah. Amanda shakes me. Dad! Come on! <laughs> this hasn't worked. This hasn't worked on me since I was six. Sorry, Amanda. This is the end for me. Dad, I swear to God, without a capital G. Amanda, I bequeath to you all of my earthly possessions. Spread my ashes over my recliner. <laughs> Done. Okay. Well, your corpse better get into the moving van because it's leaving soon. Mm. I finally open my eyes and sit up. I'm lying in the middle of the living room. Is your daughter black? Spooning a moving box. I yes. go on a stretch. I think she's mixed. Or uh, whatever. They they I think they made her look like she could be like any race because you can make your dad any race and then you could date and your they they yeah, made they, her look it's... They made her look like she could be like a mixture of anything really. Which is fair enough. I mean yeah. they're they're making a visual novel for everyone. Yeah, yeah. Uh uh morning manda panda. <sighs> Ugh, dad breath. Go brush your teeth. Dad, uh, bring a war chest. Always bring a war chest. Pay, Pay your, your bills, bills early. early. Build that dad. Build right. that dad. We, gotta build, we gotta build Caleb. So, what are the differences here? Well, there you go. Hold, hold on. I don't know. I'm, Caleb, let me look at those arms. I think that. Yep, yep, yep. All right. Uh, there we go. Uh, the head. C Caleb, give me a give me a nice profile here. You actually have a fairly decent jawline, you asshole. Thank you. <laughs> Sit here, just like. Hold on, which, uh, that one, that one. What's a sh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think because you can also add beard, so I think we we save that. Yeah. Okay. Until, like, after. All right. Uh, definitely a bit, uh, front to the side. Do they have that? Oh, okay. I think they That's, have one a little bit This lower. is, this is better. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, hold, hold on. Hold on. Goku's hair. I, I fucking see Goku's Goku's hair. Goku's hair. Yeah, but not that one. Uh, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. I would say it's maybe a darker blonde. Darker blonde. There you go. A little bit, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's better. Yeah. Eyes? What color are your eyes? Oh, uh, like about, like, hazel, like, greenish. Yeah, all right. Uh, the, the, yep. Yep. See. <laughs> oh my god. Nobody can see this. Quinn just crawled up on the kinda, sofa to look like at his. You like a green hazel? So, that, that, that or that? You should have had the camera on. That would have been funny. Yeah, that would have been hilarious. Uh, which one? Uh, Probably that one. It's more green. Alright. Yeah, that one. Alright, let's see. I might Kate. even say it's this one. I think that's closer. Yeah, all right. Yeah, you, you're, you're the one who got a real close look. Ah, yes. That's... <laughs> you skipped over the one that actually looks like it most likely might be it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> no, Why that's that's Jacob right eyes. there. That's Jacob. That one? Yeah, Jacob. I don't know. I, oh, I this for the same Jacob. Jacob. Okay. Try that very bottom corner. That might be Caleb. <laughs> It's way too open. No, there are some days though that he's like that. <laughs> the eye roll. That That's pretty him. fitting. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, oh, hold on. Hold on. 
probably that one. Yeah, wait, wait, what was the salty eyes? They have so names. Uh, the last one. That's salty eyes. Yeah. No, dude. Well, you kind of got like you gotta get a little bag under there if you can. So like those ones, I think would work. Yeah, good. yep. I, I would say definitely that yeah. one, and then just put a message somewhere saying how he hates humans. <laughs> I don't have that good of a nose. It's probably, probably give, that. Give him a Jew nose just to spite him. It's probably no. It's the, What's the know. bottom left? As no. a Roman nose, I don't have that bottom nope. thing there. That. that. Ah. No, yeah. He's got, yeah, it's not nearly no. up enough. Okay, your nose isn't on here. I would say it would be that that one with the ball on the end. It's not as big as like our ball in, but it's. Yeah, but it's there. All right. Is there a, a permanent scowl? I mean, that's probably what I put it started on. Ah! <laughs> oh! God, I just looks like Caleb's uh, thinking of that game that we played last night. Oh. Oh. <laughs> uh, uh, bros, bros. You have really thin eyebrows. Yeah, it really does. Uh, I wouldn't say uh, bad things. Yeah, like, no. Like, this one here, or this one there. That one, they they, they definitely kind of like branch beyond the eye. Yeah, but they don't have that like point. Do you make All Might? Uh, <laughs> I may be horribly wrong, but that just reminds me of All Might eyes. I don't know, they kind of get thicker in one point. Uh, try top right, let's see what that looks like. Yeah. Alright. I could go with the alt right ones. <laughs> I think the shadow might be the most fitting. Because my beard's <laughs> definitely not like that. Yes. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's go. Let's go back to the shadow. shadow. Yep. All right. Uh, facial hair. Well, you gotta change like the color of my brows a little bit there. Because my brows, I have darker eyebrows. Uh, than my God hair. damn it. You do. You have. Uh... Yeah. And just for continuity. So just be a cunt. Yep. Glasses. Yeah, you don't, I wear, don't wear glasses, glasses. anymore. Piercings. Piercings. Yep, right there. <laughs> <laughs> Clothing. Let's see. Ah, yes, the Danny Sex Bang outfit. <laughs> <laughs> I could actually see you wearing that too. <laughs> I know, it would probably be the egg nipples. Yeah, that's what I said! God that's exactly no. what I said! You Why? tell me you wouldn't wear that, Caleb? No, I fucking wouldn't. Alright, so like All right, do they have boats? Do they have boats somewhere? I don't think they have a boat one. God damn it, they don't have boats. Go with the cats. Like, yeah, cats. <laughs> cats. I can deal with Caleb cats. Caleb hates dude. cats though. I don't know. Banana's I kinda like party the party. Suit. I like the party suit. Party suit. suit. Alright. You look like the worst person to party with. <laughs> you do. <laughs> you literally look like that one Alright, party suit or cats, guys? Party suit. Party suit. Who the fuck is that Nazi dude? <laughs> Adolf Hitler? No, no. The modern day Nazi dude. Oh, uh, Caleb. I know uh, who you're talking fill about. Fill it in. Caleb Fuckboy? What the fuck is his name, though? I don't fuck. I don't remember. The guy that got punched? Yeah. The dude oh, what that the got fuck? Punched. Oh, oh caps lock is on. I'm an idiot. Can't spell my own name. <laughs> Fuckboy. <clears throat> nah. Uh, Alright. There we go. Oi. Fuckboy! Be that dad? Be that dad. I am that dad. <laughs> Peter Weller actually has a PhD in history. Richard Spencer. Oh, That's all right. His name, yeah. That looked like Richard Spencer at a really crappy party. Did Did you fall asleep packing? I got most of it done, I think. Searching on the dad's room. Dad's an asshole. <laughs> it looks like I did a pretty good job. Every box is filled <laughs> except for one. Wait, straggler. Hmm. What's in it? Looking into the box, I see a bunch of old photos and little photo albums. Whoa, I haven't seen these in years! I pull out one of the dusty albums oh. from the top of the pile and <laughs> would begin looking through it. That's the coolest baby I've ever seen. Uh, only way your mother and I, I guess. The only way your mother and I get you to stop crying was to put the sunglasses on you. Whenever we try to take them off, you start crying again. You spent the first two years of your life with sunglasses on. Hell yeah, I did. 
Halloween when you were maybe four? <laughs> oh my god, that dragon costume. You couldn't decide between being a princess or a dragon, so you went with both. Princess dragon. Better than a maid like dragon, a just guy. saying. Hey, fuck you, that show's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> It's not like Dave got triggered somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> Why do I remember crying in that dragon costume? You saw yourself in the mirror and realized you were afraid of dragons. Seeing yourself inside the dragon's mouth was a realization of your greatest fear, I think. Hmm. Right, yeah. Definitely repress that memory. Your picture looks so much like a dick. And this <laughs> was you in your horse phase. Every, every girl needs to have a really good horse phase, though. It's just like a standard. I'm telling you, though, he does look like Richard Spencer. Dad. God damn it, quit relating me to Nazis! <laughs> At an Antifa party. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know you have no authority here, but you go anyway just to be a dick. You're rolling your eyes at the stupidity. <laughs> uh, I, oh, I believe you named that plush Sir Horsington the Brave. I don't think that was his... Uh, mm -hmm. no, alright, yeah, yeah, this is you. Amanda lunges for the photo, but I quickly snatch it away and hold it above her head with my superior dad arms. Superior arms. There you go, sounds like Caleb. <laughs> it does. Nice. I am superior. Fear me. Nice try, but this is important blackmail for later down the road. Go ahead and try me. I've seen pictures of you and your ska band. See, like Richard Spessing. Ouch. In real life, you kind of look like that. <laughs> Jesus. He has a better chin than me, though. <laughs> After I was just complimenting your chin. Yeah, fuck you, Quinn. <laughs> no, like, look he is a pretty sexy white dude. Uh, uh, look. Yeah. The scanniest manifesto. If he wasn't a racist, racist, wasn't a racist asshole, day. yeah. Uh, anyways, what was that? The scammunist manifesto had a chance back in the day. That sounds like something you'd name a ska band. <laughs> Oh, Scommunist? Scommunist. Scommunist, okay. Yeah. He was, he was naming a ska band. That sounds like what you'd name it. I mean, let's be honest. Yeah. I mean, there's always, like, uh, Adolf Hipster in the Vinyl Solutions. I still like Jay Christ and the uh, Disciples. <laughs> hey, it's Emma P. No, Dad, that's Emma R. I didn't meet Emma P until high school. Honey, I promise you wholeheartedly that I will never stop mixing those two up. Aww. Dad, Emma R has been my best friend since I was seven. Give it, like, a little bit of effort. Oh, right. Emma P was the one who... Make the decision! Go! Uh, uh... Pooped your pants one. during no, a sleepover. Middle, middle. Fine, Flaming middle. tennis ball's cool. F fired a flaming tennis ball. Lighter fluid, tennis ball, tennis racket, right? Dad, that was you! Shit! <laughs> <laughs> I'm a god. Alright, Caleb, uh, uh, Moose, now that you're here, you're taking over Amanda as well as the uh, emo dad. <clears throat> Alright! I was a wild child. <laughs> uh, Moose walked away. I was six when you did it! Okay, Amanda, I wasn't aiming for the police station, just happened there was a police station in the vicinity of where I wanted to hit a flaming tennis ball. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I remember you explaining that to the police. They didn't believe me either. <laughs> anyway, I gotta show this to Emma R later. She'll get a kick out of it. <clears throat> the first Boy. photography award you ever won. Oh. Yeah, and it got us a $20 gift card at McFriday's. <laughs> Try harder, make a more girly voice. From the cheesy toads. Tostada? What the? Oh, Tostada. Never mind. <laughs> Cheesy Tostada blasts. All those fucking Z's. Maybe I'll take back Amanda from Moose. I think you mean food poisoning, Good you name. know, with a Z. Uh, Dad! <laughs> I can tell you now, she's not actually like, I, I hate you, Dad, kind of person either. She's no, but she's, she's like, being the very, you know, teenage approach. Dad, can't come drive on! past McFridays without gagging. Still proud of you, though. Amanda reaches deep down in the box and pulls out one last photo. Neither of us say a word. We stare at the photo for a long moment. I finally decide to break the silence. Uh, this is the day you're born. It's kind of a funny story. 
Got into a car accident right there in the hospital parking lot. It wasn't anything big, just a fender bender, but of course I was freaking out. And the little old lady who crashed into us was freaking out, and I didn't know what to do. So, I, from what I understand, and I may be horribly wrong, but I seem to recall <clears throat> watching uh, one of the people who worked on this game playing it. This is actually a story of theirs. Oh, of, really? I think either when they were born or when their child was born. I don't know which it was. Just uh, something I picked up somewhere. I, I might have been on the Kitty Cat Gaming channel, I, I think. Maybe, I uh, 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 whatever. But your mother, oh man. She holds my hand and looks me directly in the eyes, the calmest I've ever seen her. She says, it's okay, it's all gonna be okay. Isn't that supposed to be your job? She was right, you know. I stare at the picture longer, maybe too long. I miss her. Teardrop Can't even calls. imagine what it must be like for Amanda. She pats me on the back. Don't touch me. <laughs> Don't touch me. Come on, Pops. We gotta finish packing. The moving van won't wait forever. You're right. Also, a good heads up. It would be more fitting if uh, Caleb would be the Dracula character as well. Sorry, man. I can't just talk to myself all the time. Well, yeah, sorry, Caleb just has to play every he's character. Like hyper fancy and shit. I'm sorry, Moose. You fit. You fit the you visual appearance. Do you envision me as hyper fancy, Austin? No, but I know you can do a fucking fancy ass accent. And no, he's he's like got to be he's got to be the guy that looks like a uh, suburbanite dad dude. And he's like my uh. Uh, anyways, Caleb. Let's see. Amanda and I pile into the car and take one last look at the old house. So many memories here. Hard to believe your mother and I bought this place almost 20 years ago. Hey, remember when I... Okay. Shattered. Remember when I shattered the front window playing catch? You always had very strong arms. <clears throat> Michelle Obama. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Uh, um, remember when I shattered the other front window pretending to be a robot who breaks windows? It's a very specific game You were a very imaginative child. I feel like your look was just like, you know, very much what it would be like. Uh, remember when I broke the back window, play- We get it, Amanda. You break stuff. And there will be plenty of more stuff for me to break at the new place. Memories to be made, and memories to make, and stuff to break. Yeah, that face looks exactly like what I bet any dad in this current situation would look like. <laughs> you ready? You sit in silence for a moment. I watch my daughter grow up in this house. It will forever hold a place in my heart, but it stings a little bit to leave it behind. How old is she supposed to be? Uh, I think she said teenager. School, so probably I'd assume around at least 15. So what do you uh, think? Maybe like sophomore I'm ready. Year? Either sophomore or junior is what my um, assumption would be. I know. I think the assumption was she's a senior. Is she? Oh, yeah, all right. So she's like 17 or 18. All right. The moving van begins to pull away. <laughs> and I get the car in a position to follow it. I watch her house, our old house, disappear in the rear view mirror. So... So what? So, sell me on her cool new pad. I clear my throat and do my chest best cheesy announcer voice. <clears throat> Nestled in beautiful, scenic downtown Maple Bay, our new house features. What the fuck? What, what should it feature, guys? Washer, what do you look for in your house? If I was picking a house, I do like a big garage. Multiple rooms is good, too. I think I'm gonna go washer and dryer hookups. That'd be just, that'd be useful. Have your own washer and dryer. Well, I'd imagine that's standard I mean, that in is. any house. But dude, that's, I got fucking choices. If I'm gonna choose, I'm gonna choose washer and dryer. Honey, have you ever had dirty clothes? For most of my life, yeah. Well, worry about that no longer, as our new place features mesh machinations. Mach machinations that will not only clean your clothes, but dry them directly thereafter. An upper class luxury, it just I like fear. Caleb. The concept of clean clothes is no longer in the hands of the fat cats upstairs, sweetie. Anyway, it's also smaller than our last house. Cozier, one might argue. Good spin. I think it's great! Won't we be closer to a lot of cool stuff that we can walk to so I don't have to waste gas? And I mean, trying to bark t park downtown is, or, y you know. Amanda, you know you're going to have to learn how to parallel park at some point, right? Oh my gosh. <laughs> like like daughter, like father, bro. <laughs> well, how is your parallel parking? I can do it, but I fucking hate it. I hate it, but I'm pretty good at it. Not going to happen, Pops. 
I think someone needs to do a three-point turn on their attitude. <laughs> I don't know how to do that either. That's a problem. Yeah, that's like easier than... Uh, have you met the neighbors yet? Not yet, but the neighborhood seems pretty quiet. <laughs> so you won't have to chase any rowdy teens off your lawn? You're the very teen you mock when you say that, honey. <laughs> I'm in my last year of high school. I'm practically dust. <laughs> yeah, you're a real... Don't you dare. Senior. Ah! Dad, Dad joke! <laughs> Dad, I know where this is going. Dad joke made! <clears throat> Citizen. Why isn't Jacob here? <laughs> I'm just gonna ignore that. But I won't forget it. Fucking anonymous. Okay. <laughs> so what's item number one in the new house agenda? Well, first we'll need to forge a path through the solid wall of boxes that's blocking the living room. I still have to install the washer and dryer. We need to go grocery shopping. Mm -hmm. Pops, cool your jets. You have to promise me that we're gonna take a break and explore the neighborhood. Okay, okay, you're right. We'll get some work done, then check the area out. Alright, and we'll be back next time. <laughs>